Hi there, my name is Kinsley James. You're welcome to Swift Studios. Now, in this lecture series, I'm going to be teaching you how to create a curved window making use of uh, Mullion in Revit architecture. Now, as we proceed, I want you to kindly click on the subscribe button on your screen so that you get you know subsequent notification of my video releases. So catch you in the class. I want to put a Lumion, uh, sorry, a Mullion window here okay a curved one so what i'm going to do is that i'm going to let me go to the level where i can assess the plan view so i want to put it here what i'll do is that i'll come here i'll first of all create an opening on this side okay let me let me take you back to 3d first i'll create an opening by selecting the same wall then i'll edit it select so uh, edit profile now come to the view where i can see it very well so i'll for the purpose of this lecture i'm just going to be very fast about it i don't want to start putting a uh, dimension it is for it's assumed that you already use revit but it's just that you're having one or two issues so I'm going to delete this now then select arc you know take it up so somebody actually called me he said uh, he's having issues with this so I, I was like it's very simple so now that I've done this I'll now go and create you know if you go if you check now so that place is going to be open so by the time I will now go to level one in that opening I'll create a wall which I'll now use and create it inside it's going to complain but you don't worry about it check it in you can see the wall and click outside entering that place so I'll select it first of all let me make it uh, there's no need to constrain it I can just go ahead and select edit then go to this point here now the next thing to do is I can erase it then come here select a pick line so you can see it's very simple and finish the editing now when I come to 3d this is what it looks like okay so I'll now convert this to glass by coming here selecting it come here down you see cutting wall let's select this one first for instance now you see that it is just glass so I'll go back and select it so I'll edit type duplicate just call it say kc wall anything just give it a name the idea of editing it so that you don't destroy the first one just in case you that's the original one just in case you make a mistake now I haven't done that then I'll come to let me move uh, horizontal that's the first the grid you need to put a grid Uh, maybe you use you want to use a fixed distance like this is 1500 I can use uh, say 800 do the same thing for the horizontal distance let it, let it be fixed distance too and let it be 800 the same thing as I want to have a square you can make it something else then let's check and see what's up so you can see the grid now so this is what it's going to look like then we can now apply our mullion to it so I'm wondering why uh, people are having issues with this and come I haven't done that now I want to add the mullion so what I've added is just the grid lines so let's check uh, circular times depend let's apply this and see what it looks like it's complaining 
I'm not, I'm not gonna do that. Let me cancel it. Let me use a uh, Sakula 50. Let's see what's up. Yeah, but this it looks kind of big. I don't like that. Let me use a uh, square rectangle 30. So you just so I think this kind of work. So I'll go to the horizontal to horizontal mullion square or rectangle 30. So that does it. So it's as simple as ABC. So guys, as I can create your own uh, unique window, you know, using a uh, mullion. So thank you. Kindly subscribe to my page. God bless you.